Um, welkom, welkom. Uh, Tineke. <laughs> Hi, hey, nice hello, to Cindy. <laughs> Hi. Nice to meet you. So we switch to English. <laughs> yes. Wow. So amazing. So I'm so happy to have you uh, here in our um, Heart and Soul Power Talk um, because um, you are for me really a true example of um, feminine, uh, yeah, of leadership. Um, so you, you've had so many life experience. Um, you have so much business experience. And so I'm, I'm so grateful to have you uh, today and, and um, uh, so that you can inspire us and and uh, so so let's see what happens because we have a big surprise um, <laughs> a very something. big surprise yes yes something um something magical something exclusive that is going to happen very soon so for the people that are listening and and feel like oh my god this resonates and i really i'm in for a total rebirth a total change of my life and my business keep listening <laughs> so welcome uh, tineke and um I understand it's now uh, about uh, six in the evening, right? Yep. There in six Bali. The <laughs> oh, <Yes>. Okay. <laughs> nice, nice. And you told me that here it's like raining, but you told me that it's it's freaking hot where you are right now. I know. I know. Yeah. You know, just an hour ago, I got back from the beach, getting ready for this interview. Um, drinking a little cocktail because it's happy yeah. hour <laughs> <laughs> um, nice yeah but you know i live here in bali uh, for the for the winter season i started last uh, winter to escape the netherlands and then i tried one month because i thought you know I, I i need to know if if i'll be okay on my own i thought i would but you never know and a month was far too short so now i'm here two months in bali and it's I'm loving my life. I'm living my dream life. Wow. Yeah, I can work wow. here. I can work anywhere. So, yeah, I work in the mornings and in the afternoons I play. And uh, today the play was going to the beach. And tonight it's there's a, a Balinese evening here in the in the resort where I am. So we have dancers and we have a nice uh, couple of uh, Australian women joining our table. I'm here with a friend, a boyfriend. So yeah, it's uh, it's all happening. It's beautiful. Wow, wow, and you're really re radiating. So I can feel <laughs> your energy. And um, we know each other for quite a while. Uh, so yeah. a few yeah. years ago, when you were having the um, the business uh, club, the business women's club, which uh, is is an international, uh, which was an international club. So that's where we met for the first time. Um, mm. And so, so meanwhile, there has been a lot of changes in your life. Oh, yeah. and yeah. in your businesses so yeah. um and i'm really curious um uh, because who who is tineke now who who are you actually and and what 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 is the legacy you want to leave behind and i know it's like a big question <laughs> uh, but but i'm just curious what comes up when i when i um when you hear that question who who i am now is just happy um, I am. I am daily and my life is exquisite. Um, I'm free. I do what I love. Um, I do need to work, but I can work wherever I want to work and I don't have to work the whole day. So I work, uh, you know, when I was the masculine woman, I would say I work smart, you know, only I'm focused. Uh, I have my tools. I have my team. But now I work smart in the feminine way. So I feel what do I need to do, what resonates, what don't. Uh, and, and actually, I only do what I feel like doing in the moment. I have my routine. There is my social media daily, yeah, my, my social media and, and my email. And then whatever comes up. So now we're, we're talking here and the rest of the day I was on the beach. Uh, afternoon so it's it's really like like this and things are happening in this way um actually so much easier so much more flow than when i was working the hard way and i was like working and working and you know being the hardcore masculine successful businesswoman according to the masculine way of success i'm a lot less successful now but 
I'm living my life and I'm a lot happier now. Wow. So what's, wow. what's more important, you know? <laughs> Yeah, nice. Yeah. Oh, I can, I can so much see the difference when I, uh, when we spoke um, mm. before last week, a few years ago, um, um, I see a totally different um, wo woman and leader here in front of me, which is really inspiring. And uh, I guess um, I'm, I'm just curious because you said, the, the okay, legacy, yeah, yeah, the, the yeah. Legacy you asked me, yeah. Yes. So, do you want me to speak? The, the legacy I want to leave behind is you know, I've been discovering the last few years how masculine our society is, and especially how masculine doing business is. Because, and, and it's, I love men, and they've done a marvelous job, and we need them on board, but they have created a game, the game of how business is being done for million uh, 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 centuries thousands of years you know they they've always been the ones doing business so it's their game and and now since 50 years we're we're entering that game and the rules of the game are suiting the man very very well um and and it's not easy for us women to become successful in the in the definition success always has been defined numbers scale uh, money uh, s scalability um, and many women don't feel successful if that's the 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 the, the way we measure success um, we for us it's all about making an impact you know changing lives changing people um, I'm having an interview here can we do this later, please? I'm being recorded. <laughs> yeah, it's just 15 more minutes. Come on, please. Leadership. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, okay, sorry, I'm distracted. Uh, yeah, you know, this is how it happens. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Everything is meant yeah. to be. So... Um, yeah. So, so my, 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 really my legacy will, is, is that, that will, I really want women to experience that this is the way it is and that this is the reason why it's so much more difficult for us, that we're not to blame. We just need to play the game by our rules and by our energy and by our skills. And yeah, we do need to adopt some skills of the masculine, but do it smart. And that's what I'm all about. I'm about harmonizing those two. And I know because I was the hardcore masculine woman. Um, so yeah, that, that will be my legacy. Women becoming more feminine. And you know what? It serves not only yourself and your business, it serves your relationships as well. It serves everything. Because when you, when you become that soft feminine woman, people love you a lot more men love you a lot more your husband will love you a lot more there's no more arguments and that's that's what i experience so i think yeah life is easier if we do it that way and that's what i want to leave behind wow thank you thank you so much and i i totally agree with you and i think that's why we resonate so much um so um i'm wondering because you are a pioneer and um so you have had for 34 years of business experience um so what what was for you the biggest breakthrough moment in uh in your life uh, that totally shifted everything can you share a bit about that moment there 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 have been many so it depends what phase of my life you speak about you know getting children was a big shift in how i do business um my divorce was a big shift in uh, in in finding my lost self playing my own roles again not playing the role of being uh, the, the the wife but also now my children i have two grown up daughters 19 and 22 they've left the house so i am now a lot more free and i i'm not playing the role of mom anymore the way i used to you know now i'm just 
I just had a little chat with her, one of my girls, and she, apparently she's in Egypt. I didn't know, but now I know. And she's, <laughs> and, you, and you know what? She met a really beautiful man there, and she traveled to go and see him there. And I think, wow, you know, this is beautiful. And how synchro synchronized our lives are, because. I was dating a man and he traveled to see me over here in Bali and we're having a beautiful time as well. You know, I think this is how motherhood becomes when, when, yeah, things, things are aligned. So biggest shift I think for me was COVID. Uh, at first I was like, okay, let's swift. I've had so many crises in my business, you know, after 35 years, every se five to seven years, there's, a, there is an international crisis that affects businesses. So I've had my fair share already and I always survived. Yeah, I was good at surviving. So I did this uh, as well. And, and after COVID, I, I, I didn't feel like playing that game anymore. And, and I really didn't want to chase and what, oh, I was so, so done with it. And everything started to fall apart. So I had to let go of my team. I had to let go of my office. That was my second home. It really was my house. Um, I had to let go of um, the, the things I perceived on how, the kind of businesswoman I am. Um, and I was lucky. Oh, no, I was. I've, you're never lucky. Things are created and, and there are no coincidences. But after 17 years, uh, my dad had, had already died 17 years ago. And finally... I got his inheritance, so it gave me the possibility to to live and do whatever I wanted in the in two years. I started a, a voluntary organization. I built it from scratch. It's She Credit, and it's where we finance female entrepreneurs because female entrepreneurs have very very difficulties finding receiving money, getting money, eh, and finding capital to go, to scale their businesses. So that's what I still do. I'm not being paid, but. I didn't have to be paid and I started teaching swimming classes again. You know, I used to do this 40 years ago and it's so much fun being in the water with the kids. Um, and all of a sudden I came up with this idea of, of doing a retreat. And I think we're going to talk about this soon. Eh? Exactly. Do you, more, do you have more questions? Uh, no, I, I think it's fine. I mean, this is, um, for me, I think your biggest breakthrough story, what you're you're going to explain right now. So please, please go ahead. I think people, what people want to know is what, what really uh, helped you to step out of that masculine. And that's what you're exactly sharing. What now. So go me, ahead. What, what helped me was support, a coach. I would not have been able to do this on my own. I had someone clearing my energy on a distance, clearing all the energies of hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and thousands of years of reincarnation. I, I believe it was 10,000 years. Um, so there was a lot of stuff to clear. There was a lot of energy to clear. And yeah, I stepped more into the feminine energy. Uh, um, and it was difficult because there were days that I was, I have to start doing something, you know, the masculine action. I have to do something. I can't just not hang around and do nothing and play and have fun. But it's all about being. It's not about doing. It's about being. And then the doing follows. But then it's aligned action. And that's what I discovered. And I was at a retreat in Mexico with my coach. Um, and there I discovered my, my spiritual gift. I knew I was a spiritual person, but I always, I was hiding it a bit because I didn't want to share that and, and mix that with my business. Uh, um, but it was inevitable. It, it had to happen. You know, I was doing Reiki with my kids and stuff for years, uh, and, and on myself, but never, never talked about it. So it's, it's a long story and people can look it up online on my YouTube channel, The Healing Powers of Water. But eventually I, re I found out I can heal water. I can energize water with my energy. And water molecules, when they become coherent, and coherent is that all the water molecules vibrate in exactly the same spe speed, exactly the same vibration, transmit exactly the same frequency, receive exactly the same. That's coherence. And everything in nature is striving for coherence. We as human beings 
our body strives and longs for coherence. So when people enter the water, I have a pool or uh, yeah, swimming pools, or I have a little whirlpool at home. When people enter that water, first is they start to relax. They completely relax. People fall asleep even. Some people who have difficulties wow. sleeping for years, they fall asleep. Um, and you know, if, if you had math uh, at school, you know about communicating vessels. Eh? There's there's one vessel with a lot of water and there, there is a little tube and there's a vessel with little water. It always wants to go to the same level. And that is what happens with the water molecules in your body. They want to match with the water, the coherent water I energized. So your body, your water molecules are coming into a coherent state. And from that coherent state whilst we're in the water if we then do business talk because i used to be a business consultant for many years and you know i've had all my businesses so for me business is like check 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 you do this you do that you know it's it's so easy it comes so natural um that's what i do and i thought you know what i'm going to organize a retreat whilst i'm in bali i had already decided to go to bali but I thought, whilst I'm there, why not? It's it's the most energetic place in the world. Ubud, where I'm staying, it's the most energetic city of the world. You even called it the heart chakra of the world. And I'm noticing yes. it since I'm here, everything flows. There's, I think, something, and the next day it's there. Everything is manifesting so easily here. And of course, I've worked hard, you know? I've, I've worked, I did a lot of energetic clearing, and I do that daily. But I think the energy here helps. It really helps. So yeah, I'm doing a retreat. And then I spoke to you about it on LinkedIn because I think I congratulated you with your birthday. No, not your birthday because that's the 4th of March, but <laughs> something else. And then we started talking and I told you, this is where I am. And you were, well, that's your part of the story. What happened? Yeah, yeah. So actually, indeed, um, um, what you said, uh, Tineke, makes so much sense. So and I feel that my um, um, I put as an intention that uh, this year I'm going to host uh, three retreats abroad. And so one of uh, my favorite uh, um, countries uh, or one of my favorite destinations was Bali. <laughs> so when you told me like... Uh, Hey, I'm, I'm hosting a retreat in Bali. I immediately felt um, uh, the attraction and I could also um, see what is the, um, the power of combining both our gifts because um, uh, what my gift is, is indeed uh, connecting people um, to their body, to the wisdom of their body and really, um, yeah, in a very fast and painless way to... Um, to um, to allow higher frequencies to move through uh, the body, so um, it was just for me like okay, this is gonna happen. So so we have some big news. Um, so uh, we we are gonna host this retreat together uh, in Bali. So uh, the newborn Bali retreat uh, we call it, and um, so this will be the first uh, time. Uh, so it will be very exclusive, and um, I, I think this is really for um, yeah for pioneers, for feminine leaders who really feel like okay, I've been going on for a while, um, and the way I I've been going on is more in the masculine ways, from the head, uh, from the strategy, and um, who feel that there is something bigger. And um, I feel that I have a huge legacy I want to leave behind, but I'm still not, um, I don't know how, you know, and then we get stuck in the head. And I think this is an amazing opportunity um, for um, for you if you if you hear this interview and you resonate with what um, what Tineke shared and and um, uh, and of course I'll probably you know me so if you feel like this is um, I feel that uh, 2024 is is my year of being a reborn of really doing things differently um, it's like you said Tineke everything is energy and so um, um, for me everything is is frequency so um, the higher the frequency um, the, the the more easy life becomes and um, what is very important and what I 
I notice with a lot of feminine leaders uh, is that they are totally not connected with their bodies. So um, they are looking outside themselves, giving away their power, like, oh, I need to, to have this strategy, I need to do this, that. And, and the only thing we have to do is just uh, remember the wisdom of our own bodies. And that's what my zone of brilliance is. Um, so to really uh, start remembering um, all the wisdom that is in you, all the, um, yeah, everything you need, the gold, I would say, is is in you. And from that, um, together with um, healing the body on a very high level with, with your gift, um, yeah, you will be totally reborn and you will make yeah. it like a totally new start. So perhaps you can explain a little bit um, about... Um, so when the retreat is happening yeah, yeah. in, in general will. and what people oh, can yeah. expect. <laughs> there's, there's one thing I wanted to say, you know, the strategies are extremely important, but they have to come from the right place and the right energy and vibration, because that's when masculine and feminine harmonize. We cannot just run a business the feminine way because we have to take action and action is masculine, but it has to be driven by the feminine. So strategies are, I'm a very strategic person and I help always, I help my women with strategies because I'm, I'm really good at that. Um, but it has to be initiated by the feminine. And I think that's the big shift that you're going to make when you join our uh, retreat. Um, I've traveled that way. You help women doing that. So it's we, we've both transitioned eh, from a masculine exactly. strategic business owner, uh, all about making money, to now being the persons that we are. And, and I think we're both so much happier. And that's, that's what I really desire for all the women who join the retreat. No more insecurity, no more failures, no, no more chasing clients no more money issues you know it it has to flow it's got to be easy and and so i need to start wrapping up because the in in uh, the balinese evening is starting to happen guess okay. start, right? okay. i picked i picked a spot at the restaurant which is the best wi-fi but very quick <laughs> the the retreat is from the third till the eighth of march now you might get crazy because this is in three weeks times so yes <laughs> and this is where the universe will step in because if this is right for you you'll know you'll know you'll feel it and then all of a sudden miracles start to happen to make this possible for you and then you'll know you have to be here this is this is how it works you know if if you have to do a lot and if your mind is going crazy i want to go but i can't because i have this I have a, it's not going to work you won't arrive here but if you can let go of all the chit chat in your head and feel, feel that you really, really, really desire to be here on the 3rd of March, which is in three weeks time. And there is quite a significant flight as well. But once you arrive here, we'll massage, uh, there's massage therapist, Bali is full with massage therapists, will massage all that stress of your flight away so that all the toxins in your body are gone. We'll have a special chef, an Ayurvedic chef, so you'll have to do a little quiz so that you uh, answer some questions and you'll get tailored food for your specific Ayurvedic type so that your body is, and, and your digestion and the food is not hindering you raising your energy and vibration. It's, it's very important. Every morning we do water healing sessions before we have breakfast um we have a few out outside uh, trips they are with water we go to a natural waterfall beautiful place serene place in nature very high energy um and we'll go to the ocean for snorkeling bali has one of the most beautiful snorkeling reefs in the world so if you have a waterproof camera do take it we'll have a guide there's nothing to worry about <laughs> I've been snorkeling a lot, so but there is also a professional uh, guide with us. We'll go on a boat, so you know it's just um, we ha we, it's an amazing trip. Um, 
then we'll have the Reiki sessions and Cindy will do her work in a group and one-on-one. -on -one. I will do my work in a group and one-on-one. -on -one. And both what we do, it, it doesn't double the effect, but it triples the effect. So this has never been done before. I already have guests for the retreat because I have been selling it on my own. And Cindy said, and, and I remember she told me years ago, you know, Tinika, I feel we need to do something together. And I was then, yeah, yeah, women always want to work together with me because they see how quick I am, how fast I am, how successful I am. You know, I was the masculine woman. And I thought, no, no, no. But now it's the right time. It's, it's yeah. the right time. Yeah. And, and yeah. we've been preparing this the past two days. And it's flowing. It's, yeah. You have yeah. To, yeah. If, if you feel that this is your call, reach out to me or reach out to Cindy. And I do want to talk to you personally before you decide to book your flight uh, and before you decide to, to come, because it's, it's important for us that you're here for the right reasons. But you can talk to Cindy or you can talk to me, uh, whatever you prefer. Yes. Yeah, so thank, but, thank but you so much. Special, yeah special price don't we i think that's your, yes uh, your yes exactly so so just to add on what uh, Tineke uh, said so as you hear it's really uh, very exclusive and very luxury so um and especially one like very much one on one so so it's really the combination of um yeah really uh, cleaning up everything like making a new start i call it like i told you like the energy of the newborn that you can really make a new fresh start from the inside out so and from there you can build your new life your business which will be totally aligned so i will be doing also one-on-one -on -one sessions i will be teaching you how to work with the quantum field how to raise your frequencies how to um, uh, um, how to find to tune your pineal glands so that you can create much faster but um so the investment um so that's of course also important as you said um if you feel this is for me there will be no obstacles and you can just go in the flow and everything will be there um so we have uh, the investment uh, at this moment is six thousand euro uh, so everything is included except for the flight that you have to arrange for yourself um and we have a special discount um of thousand euro so uh, if you decide before friday night um you you have you can join this exclusive business retreat uh for uh, five thousand euro and um so if you have any questions you can uh, contact uh, tineke by email by whatsapp and i think it's yeah there is a difference of seven hours so um so i'm available for the rest of the day so send me a text message a whatsapp or send me an email and then uh, we can have the call together so yeah and we, we only we only have three spots left eh? so I, know, if, if you feel this is where you really really see yourself being and, and and giving this gift to you just act you know and that is acting on awareness that is you know you you'll know and that's exactly what we're going to teach you the inner knowing the yeah. connection with your body, with your higher self, and move from there. And then everything you do is aligned and everything works. And you create miracles every day. Amazing, yeah. And I, I just feel that indeed this is uh, meant to be. And yeah. this is really like the divine uh, uh, intervention, I call it. And this is the magic where I'm working with when when, when you're really in... Yeah. To both in us, alignment right? exactly yeah. in alignment with that feminine energy so um i'm gonna wrap it up now so perhaps uh one question like very very short like if you look back on your life now is there one advice that you could uh, would give the young tineke like that golden nugget um for your younger self Stay is out there of something your head. Stay out of your head. <laughs> <Stop> <laughs> <thinking>. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Tineke. I'm I'm uh, so looking forward to our retreat, and um, thank you for hey, this we'll, amazing we'll, interview. I'll, I'll, 
go in three weeks and it's your birthday on the 4th. It's my birthday on the 7th. So this is what the retreat will do. We'll be celebrating our birthdays together during the retreat. So who wants to join? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much. And uh, it's like you said, everything is meant to be. So um, we're going to have a lot of fun and create a lot of magic together. All right. <laughs> thank you. Have a Bye. nice evening. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>